in terms of what Hamas did on October the 7th, do you accept that was an act of terrorism? It's an interesting question because once it's not again, really. It is. It's no, a very it straightforward question. Because you're the person who would have called Nelson Mandela a terrorist while he was still in jail. And one person's terrorist is another person's freedom fighter. I wouldn't for have me to him answer that. the question Yes, you would have. For the for me to answer the question, I have to be very professional, Pierce. For me to sit on the outside in Romania with no personal involvement in Israel Palestine, it's easy for me to say yes, it was an act of terror. However, if I was in Gaza, if I was in an open air prison, if my family had been annihilated by bombs from mm. the sky. Mm. If everybody I knew had suffered the loss of a loved one, if I had no chance of any kind of freedom or democracy or standard of life, would I believe it was an act of terror or would I believe it's an act of resistance against oppression? You have to be very careful how you answer these so questions. So what do you think? I think I understand what happens when you take people and put them in such an inhumane condition. So For anybody is, to sit and say that you're going to take people and put them in absolutely inhumane conditions uh, and give them no standard of life, and they're not allowed to ever fight back or they are But I can agree with you. Anyone